boys and girls, I know when we talk about being writers, we often talk about writing stories and telling um, things that happen to us. But as adults, another thing that people write are cards. So I don't know if you know this, but on Sunday, it's Mother's Day, the day we celebrate our moms. Moms do a lot for us. So I thought I would make my mom a card and I thought you might like to watch. So I found an old piece of paper. It has a big rip in it here, but other than that, it looks like a perfect piece of paper to use. So I'm just gonna take my scissors and cut up here. So I make sure I cut off where it is ripped. And now my paper's fine, no need to throw that away. So I'm gonna take my card and I'm gonna fold it in half. Now, I don't know if you have ever gotten a card before. Cards can go this way, like they open like a book, or they can open this way from the bottom. I think I'm gonna make my card like that today. And I think on the front, um, I'm going to put a design. I'm not gonna put any words on the front. Well, you know what? That's not true. I think I will write some words, maybe love, good words like that. I've got my crayons, I've got a glue stick, and I found this piece of little piece of paper that I thought I would use too. If you have scrap paper around, great. If you don't, that's okay too. You can draw other things, you can make things. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut out a heart. Nice big pink heart for my mom. If I didn't have this pink paper, if I didn't hadn't found it, I probably would just draw a heart right here on my picture, on my card. But since I have it, I'm gonna use it. Might as well use it instead of throwing that piece of paper away. A little piece of glitter. All right, so right here's my card. And now I'm going to, I'm gonna to add to it. I'm gonna use my crayons that I have here. Um, I think I'm gonna draw, I think I'm gonna draw another heart inside that one and I'm gonna make it like that pinky red. So I'm gonna do a little bit of both. And then I think I'm gonna do Oh, I think this color will look cool. So I'm gonna go maybe around it this way. And I think I'm gonna make this say, I heart for love and you. I know how to spell I, it's one of our sight words. So one of our rainbow words, yeah. So I'm gonna, hmm, I'm gonna pick a pretty color. I think I'm gonna pick red, because my mom likes red. I'm gonna make my I. And then the heart's the love part. And then I'm gonna write you. I think that looks like a good front of my card. You can add flowers, you can add rainbows, whatever you think your mom would like. Or maybe you're gonna make it for grandma. I don't know. Inside, I'm gonna write what holiday it's for. Mother's Day. I'm gonna say happy Mother's Day to my mom. And I think I'm gonna use I'm use this one. This is like that pinky red. It's called violet red. Happy. Ah. P -p 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 e. Happy. That's what I hear anyway. That's the kindergarten way of writing it, and that is just fine. Happy. M. M. A. Uh, A. Uh, th. Th. There are two letters that go th, th, like th. Thursday. Oh, it's T and H. Happy Mother's Mother's Day. And I'm going to make another heart for love. And I'm going to write Miss Sarto. You're going to write your name. Oh, and there's a space right here. I could draw something. 
I really like rainbows and I bet my mom would like a rainbow too. So I'm gonna add some more drawing to it. Orange. I've been making rainbows for my mom for a really long time. <laughs> One more color. And there you have it. A card for my mom for Mother's Day. Save it and give it to her on Sunday.